All right, I'm going to start the head here. And the first thing I, want, I need to do is scale my skull to match the uh, the drawing that I've got here. And I've cut that out of uh, this uh, illustration. But I just put the skull up there just to show you uh, how big uh, the skull is going to be. And uh, my task is going to be to uh, shape the skull to uh, match the uh, length and the size of uh, this drawing. The next thing I need to do is establish the width of the skull. And I'm going to go by this width right here. Start forming it with little dabs of clay. And you got to keep it within the uh, measurements of uh, your skull. As you can see, it's starting to take its shape slowly. So basically what you're doing, you're getting the outline of the, the skull in there and you're sketching it in and you just keep working at it until you get it to where you like it. And uh, I'll work on the other side. So now the uh, horse is starting to come into shape. The uh, head is in proportion and started and now we can start on the shoulders and all the other muscles. But uh, first I want to get this head as far as I can. Uh, before I continue on with that other stuff. All right, for those of you uh, viewing this short little video on my progress on my horse, um, I'm just getting the uh, skull sketched in. I have to be a little more detailed in this skull than I would be uh, even in some of these deep buried bones of the legs and in this and such. Uh, and the reason why is because the surface of the uh, face of the horse is dependent on the shape of the bone structure. And so you got to be as accurate as you can on that. And uh, so that's what we've been going through on the uh, video is showing you how to uh, achieve this. And get it to a point where you can start adding muscle and such to the uh, head of the horse. The actual length of the horse's head is, is going to be shorter as a skull because uh, the actual length will be that much further past the uh, bottom of the teeth right here at the, at the bottom of the skull. All right, we'll continue uh, with the uh, horse's anatomy and start uh, adding muscle to uh, the horse as I go along. I'd like to remind you that I do have uh, DVDs out on sculpting and I've got uh, nine DVDs at the moment and uh, this will make, be my tenth. Um, I put a link in the uh, video description below here to uh, a review of each one uh, of my DVDs and uh, and how to purchase them. All right, everybody. Have a great night, and I'll see you next time. Give me a thumbs up and share my video. And then check out my instructional DVDs, uh, the link down below this video. All right, see you next time.